The coin's manifestation crate. Tigers I organite for higher vibration. Citrine chips for abundance and prosperity. Bountiful smudge for cleansing. Tiger's eye for grounding. Cube calcite for focus. Pyrite for opportunities. Rough citrine for protection. Get yours for $40 with free shipping. Link below. Hi Leos, welcome to my channel. We're doing your reading. How are you? It is the last of the weeklies. Hello, hello. We are 24th to the 31st. Nag-uulat, nagbabalita, at nababaliw. Okay, how are you? If you understand what I was saying there. Okay, so first off, um, the trees are here. Go check it out. These are the the only tree that you don't need to plant and you don't need to water, but it brings you a lot of things too. Okay, love, abundance, peace. Just looking at it is so mystical. This is one of one and it's quite heavy. Ay, it is heavy. Okay, so I didn't even want to lift it. Okay, so, <laughs> so do check it out because it's the base is geodes, guys. So... Let me just move it there. All right, so do check it out. It's one of one. What you see in my table is exactly what you're getting because it's one of one, okay? Let's begin over here. Let's see what you guys got yourself into. I did the Leo um, Tarot After Dark, so make sure to check that out. Who will reach out first? Why are you still dealing with the same energy, Leo? Okay, let me see. Maybe different people already I'm reading for. So let's see what's going on. Sorry if there are noises. Okay, there's just some um, gardening happening. Okay. Next door. Here we go. Because I told the Obamas, I mean, I'm reading. The <laughs> I'm neighbors with Michelle. Love her. Okay. Here we go. Let's see. But they're doing some gardening. Okay. Here we go. Let's see. Ace of coins. The Leo got money in their mind. Uh, focus. Focus. You're going to tell me. So I want to know about my money. My money is where my life is right now. Of course, you know, with Rahu and Taurus, it's your 10th house. Your career is very important, but it's been up and down, unpredictable. And it's like, oh my God, Sal, should I quit my job, start my business, um, you know, invest? What do I got to do, you know, to make this career of mine um, stable? Ace of Pentacles. Mm -hmm. Grand opportunity, you may be taking some loans. That's Ace of Pentacles. Now, the Ace of Pentacles can also, um, you, um, trying to go out and date. Mm -hmm. Ace of Pentacles is spending time. That's the coins for me. So either you're spending time at work or you're about to spend time with someone. Remember also, I, before I started the reading, I said, will you message? Is your card? So are you, get, are you ready to be dragged? You're the one who's going to get them. Who's going to message? It's in your side. The who? Knight of Swords, they reply as fast. Yeah. You text, they reply. Knight of Swords. Isn't that assuring? If you have expectation. When I teach about expectation, for example, messages, of course, when you send out a message, there is an expectation that's going to be returned. I stopped that already. I only have expectations for myself. So my expectation today is to text someone. I will text. Do I expect you to reply? No. <laughs> it's for me to express myself. You want to express yourself, you can reply. You don't want to express yourself. That's your tea. I need to express. Now, this can be anything that I want to express. Like, you know, to my mom. Hey, mom, I need this. <laughs> I don't expect her to say yes or no. I'll just charge it. <laughs> mom. Okay. Ace of Pentacles right here. Mm. So this is when you're delivering the message, you're going to get a reply. Now, of course, you're going to see it doesn't make sense huh? because, it, you know, communication, it, uh, it takes uh, two people, right? Well, my communication is within me because I'm trying to bring peace and balance to my life. So if I have expectations for you, I'm not trying to bring balance to my life. I'm trying to bring chaos to my life if I have expectations to other people. Mm -hmm. I only have expectation for myself. How I do today, what I do today is about me. It's not being selfish because I have my own karma and I have to think about this karma. I got my own deadline. I got to do me. So you get the response with the Knight of Swords. Okay. It, it will save you a lot of wasted energy with expectations if you practice. Knight of Swords over here, um, even at work, I don't have expectation. It's weird, I know, but that's how I run it. It's no expectations here. 
you do you. Your karma will be what it is, whatever it is. Mm. So it's like me dictating to the universe. No, I can't. Knight of Swords over here. They want to say that they're sorry too. Ace of Cups. The Leo wants to be more expressive with their emotions. They're the natural fifth house, which means like they are very, very romantic. However, you are ruled by the sun. Is the sun romantic? Not at all. It's a natural malefic. It's masculine, right? So which means you probably suppress this and you have a hard time expressing it. And when you try to express it, they get confused. Why? Your second house is Virgo, right? Mercurial. And mercurial is by. By meaning like it just goes with whatever, wherever the flow is. So sometimes it's difficult for you to be understand by this person. What you want from this person is for them to love you. Are they giving you this love? Are they giving you this attention? I don't think so. Because you haven't texted or called them. And they're waiting for that message. You got a Knight of Pentacles. Uh, good luck with that one. <laughs> Leos, Leos, Leos. Why you got to choose the one that is fast, slow, fast, slow, fast, slow? Knight of Swords, Knight of Pentacles. They, sorry about that. Mm -hmm. They would text you, stop. They would call you, stop. They would be there, stop. So what is this person? Likes to play peekaboo. If this is a game in the arcade, you know the frog that comes out. So, ooh, ooh, oh, oh, So trying to catch this person to message you is rough. You have Ace of Cups though. I want you to learn to love yourself. How do you do this, Sal? How do you love yourself? By stop, you, you stop thinking about what others think of you first. Can you do that? Mm -hmm. I don't care. Do I look like I care about... Uh, no. Nah. I care about what I think of myself. Today, I was I able to do the right thing? Mm. That's it. Ace of Cups. If I love myself, I would stop thinking about other people. It's not being selfish. It's being self-aware. What I do with inside me will affect others. So if I'm loving myself, they would love themselves too. So I shouldn't even love you. I just need to love myself because the divine graces will love you and you will feel in love. I don't need to be the one to show the love. Loving myself is loving that inside person, that spirituality inside me, and that will take care of everything because I have faith. Ace of Cups. Have faith that loving yourself, Ace of Cups, is very important right now. You can thank me later. The hangman, it's too much to think about, Sal. I feel stuck for this year already. I mean, like, there's nothing going on with this person. You keep preaching, Sal, you keep preaching, but I just want to know, do they love me? Do they share the feelings? Because they haven't responded with the Knight of Pentacles. If you anchor yourself with a reply, that's your whole life essence is about, you're more than that. You're going to anchor yourself with a reply. Mm-hmm. You got the Seven of Cups over here. Mm-hmm. They're confused. They don't know what to do. They don't know how to talk to you right now. They're sitting there thinking and contemplating. You're sitting here with the hang, uh, you're hanging here with the hangman, compromising your life, waiting for someone where they don't know really what they want with their life. So now you are stuck. Mm -hmm. Let's see. You got a tower. Mm -hmm. Come judge me. Come judge me. <laughs> if you know what that means. Come judge me. Come judge me. Because the tower is here. So are you going to be judged if you end this right now? And you say, it's like my mind is made and I just don't want to be part of this. This is a three, a three major arcana. The tower is removing of obstacle. Are you thinking about how this person is going to see you if you just give up? Because the moon is about your emotions and feelings. And at the same time, your logic now, Five of Swords over here and the High Priestess. They're giving you the silent treatment for a reason. They're teaching you a lesson. Okay. Teaching you a lesson. So, no reply still. Five of Swords, they're angry with you. But there's a Two of Cups. Ay, que rico. You love someone. They love you. You guys are not talking. What's wrong here? Something does not add up because chances are there are other people involved. The Two of Cups shows intense connection. You've extended yourself with the Ace of Cups, Leo. They're too scared to accept this love. They went to hide because they're confused. They don't do this kind of emotion. 
What they want right now is to stop everything because they just want where things is right now. Casual. The moon is a needy planet. You need security because you don't feel safe right now. That there is basically nothing that ties the two of you. There is communication, there's love, there's all this, there's expression before, but you just feel uncertain because they're not giving you this kind of commitment. Link down there in the description box below for the extended. We'll see what's this person's next step. Are they coming back also? Because the high priestess is here. If it's an ex, why do I say if they're coming back? Because there's a three of cups. Are they going to message you after the breakup with the five of swords? Do you still want to be with this person with the moon card? Or are you just going to hang here for the rest of 2022 waiting for a reply? We'll answer all these questions. Link down there. Download my app, Eat, Read, Love. Available in Apple and Android. You will thank me once you've downloaded and it's free. And once you download it, turn on the notification so you get the 20% discount that gets directly to your phone. Okay? I'll see you guys again. And you're still stuck, sadly. I'll see you guys. Bye.